let's look at this set five teams gathered to play international premium league in january 2020 at the inauguration of the tournament all the five captains of the respective teams were called on stage one by one to showcase the jersey the team will be wearing during the tournament each of the five captains is categorized either as a batsman or a bowler in the team so we have uh, names of captains the order in which they turn up the order in which they turn up and whether they are a batsman or a bowler these are the three attributes you can identify straight away next is the captain of exactly one of the teams among bangalore and delhi was a batsman okay so we also have city names so city names so i go bangalore delhi one of them is a batsman and one of them is a bowler because exactly one of them is a batsman so the other person has to be a bowler okay the captain of kolkata is dhoni kolkata is dhoni he was the second person to come on stage he was the second person to come on stage among the last three captains to come to stage exactly one of them was a batsman so among the last three captains one of them was a batsman two were bowlers okay pandya was the fourth captain to come on stage now pandya being the fourth captain to come on stage hopefully you recognize it could very well be pandya belongs to bangalore or delhi so right now we'll record it separately this way pandya was the fourth captain to come on stage rest we'll worry about later there are exactly two bowlers among the captains okay if there are exactly two bowlers among the captains remember after dhoni there were three players one of them was a batsman two were bowlers so the person who comes in first the person who comes in first is definitely a batsman apart from that we have also been told rohit and rahul are batsmen so rohit is a batsman and rahul is also a batsman why i'm not recording it in the table is maybe one of them belongs to bangalore or delhi so we can't be certain we'll worry about it later rohit is the captain of the delhi team okay so captain of delhi team is rohit rohit which also guarantees that he is a batsman because rohit was a batsman so i can rearrange this he becomes a batsman he becomes a batsman and the person from bangalore becomes a bowler okay this is done the captain of mumbai is neither virat nor pandya mumbai this is neither virat nor pandya there are only five people remember then neither virat nor pandya if virat is not here pandya is not here the only person who can come in here is left is rahul so this is rahul and he is a batsman this is amazing okay next uh, at least two captains came on stage after the captain of chennai chennai has not been mentioned so far so now chennai at least two captains came on stage after the captain of chennai let's see uh, okay one more thing because after dhoni two bowlers are coming in can i say dhoni is also a batsman Dhoni is also a batsman. This is guaranteed. Now, if I have identified my three batsmen, the two bowlers are also identified. The captain of Chennai and captain of Bangalore are bowlers. Now, the bowlers, the numbers at which they could come were three, four, and five. Captain of Chennai is a bowler, and uh, I also know at least two captains came on stage after the captain of Chennai. It has to be number three. The order wise, this has to be three. Okay, if this is three. The only spot where Pandya and order four can come is here. This is Pandya and four that can come. This is known. The only other captain left is Virat. So the two captains who are bowlers are Pandya and Virat. This is known. For Rohit and Rahul, do we have clues as to what is the order in which they come? Let us go ahead and check everything all over again. The captain of exactly one of the teams was from Bangalore and Delhi was a batsman. Fulfilled. The captain of Kolkata is Dhoni. He was the second person to come on stage. 
among the last three captains to come on stage, one of them was a batsman. Uh, and one of them was a batsman, that is number five. And two were bowlers because three and four were bowlers. This is done. Pandya was the fourth captain to come on stage. Okay. There are exactly two bowlers among all captains. Rohit and Rahul are batsmen. Two bowlers are Pandya and Virat. Rohit is the captain of the Delhi team. Okay. The captain of the Mumbai is neither Virat nor Pandya. Okay. At least two captains came on stage after the captain of Chennai. Okay. So this basically means Rohit can be the first person or the last person on stage. Correspondingly, Rahul can be the first person or the last person on stage. Order-wise, I cannot fathom it further. In fact, this belief is strengthened if you look at question number 7. If Rahul came on stage earlier than Dhoni, which means Rahul's precise order on which he gets on to the stage is not exactly known. So this should give you more confidence. This working is correct. Let's go ahead and check. X represents the sum of serial number of batsmen on which they came on stage. The batsmen are 1, 5 and 2, 8. X is 8. Y represents the sum of serial numbers of the bowlers on which they came on stage, which is 3 and 4. So y is 7. Find the absolute difference between x and y. The answer to the question will be 1. 8 minus 7 is 1. For how many captains do we definitely know the serial number on which they came up? <laughs> For how many captains? I'm sorry. For how many captains do we definitely know the serial number on which they came on stage? We know it for three captains, Pandya, Dhoni and Virat. So three. Next, if Rahul came on stage earlier than Dhoni, Dhoni came in second. So Rahul coming in first is the case we are talking of. Then which team's captain came immediately after Pandya? Pandya is coming in fourth. So Rohit has to come in five, fifth then. So Rohit from Delhi. So option D, Delhi. And last question. How many of the following statements will not help us in finding the unique order in which the captains came on stage? Okay. The captain of Mumbai came before the captain of Chennai. If the captain of Mumbai came before the captain of Chennai, it is only possible if Rahul was ahead of Virat. So Rahul can only come in at one. So this does help us in finding the unique order. And the question is asking, will not help us finding. So this is not acceptable. This should not be counted. Next, Rahul was the last batsman to come. This tells me Rahul is coming in at fifth position. This is also giving me a unique case. So this should not be counted. Captain of Bangalore was the second bowler to come on stage. Captain of Bangalore is Pandya. He is the second bowler to come on stage. This is known. This does not help us resolve the order in which Rohit and Rahul are coming on stage. So fine. This should be counted. Captain of Chennai came after the captain of Mumbai. Captain of Chennai is Virat. If he came after the captain of Mumbai, it is only possible if Rahul came in first. And this does give me a unique order. So this should not be counted. So the answer to this question should be 1. And that is the entirety of this set. Thank you.